we go? We go pink? Let's go pink. 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 Hi friends, welcome back to Welcome back to my channel, or if you're new here, welcome. My name is Melissa or Mitha. This is the most fun place on the internet, as voted by my cats. Uh, today we have already had two coffees. We're on a monster. Someone asked my last video, Melissa, I thought you were addicted to white monster. I am. It's still here. <laughs> I just try and drink it less frequently now. Coffee is a great way to save money on energy juice. Today is what day? It's Wednesday. I've woken up feeling quite <laughs> manic and uh, we have some errands to run. Not fun ones, I need to go to the post office, I need to go and get cat litter and I also want to buy a new clothes horse so I can do two loads of washing at once. Isn't that the dream? And then I'm going to meet up with an old tinder flame uh, who is now just a very good friend and we're going to go for a walk because he's having a bad day. So. That's what we're doing and I thought for this I would just show you what I do for very minimal everyday makeup that is just quick and easy and looks nice and I feel good and anyway let's just start because holy crap this is a long intro so all I've done is put my brows on and I kind of wish I hadn't because they're quite bold I mean they're not at all but slightly but anyway first step Smashbox Photo Finish Primerizer Plus Hydrating Primer. This stuff is literally the tits and it's cheaper than my Bobbi Brown. So I'm kind of saving my Bobbi Brown for like more special occasions. I mean this is still pricey but everything goes on top of this really nice and my skin always looks stunning with it on. Like I <laughs> was such a toot your own horn wasn't it? Always looks so beautiful. <laughs> Moi, this feels good. It really is a lovely, lovely base for makeup. When I say makeup, we're not really doing makeup, but we are. So to continue this journey together, Fenty, Easy, Ease Drops, whatever, however you pronounce it. I always thought it was easy, but apparently not. Teensiest bit, like real small. That's what she said. <laughs> and I use a brush. To push this around. This is like me putting effort into wearing no makeup by the way because usually or like a lot of the time I will just wear actually no makeup and I'm completely fine with with doing that you know my face is my face I've learned to accept it see this is almost like nothing like if you like coverage don't buy this if you just want to look like you're evened out but still look like you're not wearing makeup you want these I just love the barely there coverage but it still gives me a wee hint of like confidence you know any concealer will do to be honest I'm really not fussy when it comes to concealer because every concealer in my drawer I absolutely adore so I'll just go for my old faithful Too Faced multi-use. The reason I especially love this, apart from the fact that it's just an excellent product, is you get so much in it for the price. So obviously the price is higher. I say this every time I use it. The price is higher, but actually it's worth it because you're getting 15 mils in here for what, 25 quid? You're paying like seven pounds for the Makeup Revolution and you only get five mils. You know what I mean? So I feel like it all kind of adds up. I'll wipe this on. My skin is looking nice. It's not looking in any way cakey. It's not looking perfected. It's not looking overly done. I'll show you my face obviously in the natural light. But like it just looks more even. Like you can still see redness and all that 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 stuff. Is that good stuff? I mean good stuff yeah. But it just looks a bit neater. A bit sidier. I'm wearing my ex-husband's old t-shirt that I did not give back to him when he was packing all the stuff up and I cropped it. I've got a sports brand, don't worry. That's the power move, isn't it? Right, I'm taking a baby wipe, which I'll use more anyway, but my Colourpop freckle pen is dying and I'm very sad about it. Uh, so if anyone's got any spare Colourpop freckle pens lying around, sell them to me, please. I hate ordering from Colourpop. I'm going to do full freckles. This is my step that I literally cannot miss now on these natural days. I 
the, I don't know what it is, I think, I think it adds to the effect that you're not really, really wearing much makeup because when you wear a lot of makeup, you kind of cover up your freckles, do you know what I mean? And I know faux freckles kind of offend some people, but I mean, that's just ridiculous. Uh, I love faux freckles. Do them pretty much every day. I've never found anything better than this Colourpop faux freckle pen. I did just get sent from Lottie London a couple of their freckle tints, but I love the like applicator on this. It's like a little felt tip pen and it actually gives you like freckly shapes. It's literally perfect. A couple of days ago I went to the post office delivery office and this is just like an example of a man giving you his opinion when you don't want it. But yeah I went and picked up a parcel and I had this kind of makeup on so to some men it looks like you're not wearing makeup because they don't know anything but he was like <laughs> he, took, he went and got my parcel put it down in front of me and went let me guess is it makeup and I was like yeah probably and he's like another girl that doesn't need makeup I was like, who asked you, mate? But also, at the same time, feminism goes out the window. And I was like, oh, thanks. <laughs> you know, it's bad, isn't it? I'm going a little bit ham with the freckles. Need to calm down. Let's go in my foundation brush. Oh, before I forget, nude eyeliner. Mine is definitely my favourite one. It's definitely the killer liners from Too Faced. They are so good. This is in killer cashmere what would be my next step powder i do powder uh, because i feel like i need to but i'm just gonna use a press powder it's my number seven one and i love it with my whole heart i'll just get rid of any creases there really isn't many creases because i don't have that much product on and then i'll just use my sponge to put a wee bit of powder that's where i need it this step is not necessary but I'm doing it today just because it's quite a grim day outside and I want a bit of joy in my life and I'm going to bring that in with some glowy powder. This glowish one from Huda is literally so good. I have yet to sing its praises properly on my channel. It's actually the glowish brush. Face all over powder. Wow. Genuinely didn't do that on purpose. Wouldn't get the brushes if I were you but the, the powder is really good. And this is shade 1. Usually I use 2 because it gives me a bit of colour. But I'm just using 1 because actually I don't really have makeup on everywhere. I mean I do but you know what I mean. This is so beautiful. It's nicer than my NARS one if you're wondering. Definitely nicer than my Makeup Revolution one but I mean that's a lot cheaper in it. But you see because like my face really matches my neck and my body. I don't need to use my slightly darker powder. Oh, I just love it. It gives the most natural glow from within kind of look and it's just perfection. I am going to keep adding a bit more makeup, although would probably go out like this. Hula Light. Next they'll be saying they're discontinuing Hula Light. You know that they're discontinuing Cookie, right? What's that about? This is going to be super basic. I'm going to not put very much on, just on each side, a bit of my forehead since my, I don't think I will wear my wig so my big forehead's out, don't even care, I used to be so paranoid about my big forehead, don't care anymore, <laughs> and then I do take a bit over my nose, highlight those freckles, do you know what song I cannot get out of my head is the Goddard remix of Go by Cat something, you should have, I should have listened to, oh, I can't even sing it. Pack up your stuff and go, <laughs> whatever. Go and play this song, Full Blast, right now. I don't know why it hits me. I've never been cheated on in my life, but <laughs> it hits me. Essence Contour Kit. What more could you want from life? I need to buy a backup of this. Mm. Tiny bit, tiny bit. In this like center part. Tiny bit. I used to do my contour from here to like here. I literally just put it in there now and I feel like it looks so much more natural and it highlights my like actual cheekbones. Mm -hmm. A bit there. Okay this this step is like pricey but I 
genuinely think worth it and I haven't found a highlighter from the drugstore that is this like what this is. This is the Dior highlighter. I'll link it below. I actually don't know what number it is because Daniela gave this to me a while ago and I can't remember. But it's like subtle but stunning. It's like glow from within. T take it to the inner corner. The, that's not. That's the outer corner. Right? Like put it in that, that bit and round your eyebrow and then all the way around in the semicircle. Because that's like where you actually like naturally catch the light. Oh! Yeah, this highlighter you can totally build it up and make it like real blingy. Or you can just keep it a bit more subtle, which is what I want on a day like today. I put it in the centre of my forehead, a little bit down the schnoz and then grab more. See mine, the cats, the cats tried to dig it out my drawer. Do you know what? I think it adds character to it. And I throw it over my eyelid. Is using this highlight brush and it's just mm, like gorgeous we need setting spray I still love my collection primed and ready dewy I think it's great and it's affordable and that just farted right on me put it on you are literally dripping wet that is what she said Okay, so funny, like that's like a rude thing to say, right? I can say that in front of my parents and they have no idea what I mean. My mirror is sodden, I can't even see through it. My t-shirt is wet. Setting spray. Just douche it on there. Wipe my mirror. This is taking 19 minutes, 30 seconds by the way, and it would take me maybe in non-filming time, 10 minutes, 15, giving myself a bit of leeway. Uh, for lips, I'm not sure what I'm going to do. For lips, I might just put a very neutral blush on. One of my favourites would be MUA Blushed in Papaya Whip. It's like a neutral peach. We peach. I might put a bit of pink over this if I end up doing more of a pink lip. But I don't know yet, so I'll just put a bit of this on just so I feel like I've got blush on. Nice matte blush, it's exceptionally affordable. I know that's subjective, but when a blush is like £2.50, I do feel like I can say it's affordable. Uh, you know what I mean. Oh, it's so nice, it's so nice. That's pretty much us. I would happily go out like this, right? We put a lip balm on. I am going to do mascara today, and I am going to put a bit of a lip on. But you could leave it here. In fact, I need my slightly darker colour pop pen. See that? That's like my actual freckle. I always make that one a bit more intense. <laughs> just before I do my mascara, just to save any runnage, I'm going to use my Iconic London uh, Prep Set Glow. This is not to set my face, this is to give me more of a glow. I love that product. It's fantastic. There is cheaper ones. Uh, L'Oreal Shake and Glow. It's the best. But mine's almost run out. So again, saving it a little bit more. Daniela is actually coming to stay with me in just less than a week. And we're going to be going out, out on the town in Stirling next Friday night. Boosh, boosh, boosh. I don't know why I'm telling you that, but there you go. Oh, it looks so good. It looks so good. Like, did I go a bit ham in the freckles? Yeah, maybe. But if you don't know me, you just maybe think they were real. But like, there's no creasing. There's no nothing sitting in the lines. There's nothing like that looks insane. It just looks nice, I think. Anyway, obviously that's what I think. I'm gonna take my cheap ass. Uh, what are these? I think I got these in Primark eyelash curlers because I don't really see the point in investing in eyelash curlers because I very, very, very rarely don't wear falsies, but I would not wear falsies on this kind of makeup. So I'm going to curl them and because it does such a good job with this uh, next product I'm going to use, I actually do think I might invest in slightly better 
eyelash curlers because I've been able to go out again without wearing falsies and it's it's quite nice. Benefit Bad Gal Bang waterproof. That's where it's at. Waterproof. Yeah, it's harder to remove, but it stays and it keeps my lashes up. And I have terrible eyelashes. We all know this. I've ruined them with years of falsies. I feel like that's fine. Obviously, it doesn't look excellent. I'm not like wowing anyone with my lashes. But for someone that has really crappy, crappy lashes, this Benefit Mascara is life. I love it so much. And hopefully this is a testament, because obviously this is quite new. My original Bad Gal Bang, I kept the thing and wiped it off and cleaned it so that I could stick it in other mascaras because I just think it is so, so good. I'm going to give that a wee second to settle. Not going to win any awards, but do they look good? Yeah, they look pretty good. Right, oh, I need to pick a lip. What am I feeling today? Am I feeling like, no, I don't think I'm feeling pink. I think pink might be a bit girly for today. Let me have a think. Let me have a think. I did a whole other lip, didn't love it. So this is Melt Lip Liner in Skin Tight. These are great, put them all over it. They will not come off, this lip will not come off all day. It's so good. Overlining my lips, definitely. Give them a bit more pout. And then I'm going over the top with Maybelline Vivid Halt Lacquer in Tees, which is my fave and you can get it for like two bucks on Amazon. Run and get it, it's so good and pale. And yeah, I like this lip. It's nice and pale, it's not too in there, like not too in your face, but it's also real pretty. Okay, that's all I have to say about that. I think that is pretty much us to be quite honest. I mean, like I said, you could add false lashes, like real natural ones or big ones, whatever you wanted. My last step, I'm going to take my Fenty Royal Icing. This again, so unnecessary. I'm just doing it because I want to and I love it on my eyelid on these natural days. I mean, am I still natural? Not really. But for me, come on, this is natural makeup. I am very pleased with this package. <laughs> uh, I think my makeup was good. It doesn't look too much. It doesn't look too little. Hair, I mean, ignore the hair. But come on, she's looking cute, right? Could she do with some falsies? Yeah. But I'm trying to work with my natural face today. So we're just accepting what we have. And I'm very happy. I will obviously go show you it this in natural light right now. Here be me in front of the big window. Makeup. I think I look quite cute. Just like me, but better, you know? And that's the point of this kind of makeup. For me anyway. I'm happy. Very happy. Oh, it's quite a nice day outside. I'm excited to go out to be honest. There we have it then, that is my version of natural everyday makeup. This would be perfect if you're going to school or work or uni or whatever, the shop, your hamster's funeral, whatever you're doing, this kind of makeup's perfect. If I had my Ardell 117s, I probably would put them on to be quite honest, just for like going out and about today, but I don't have any. I've used them all up and they're all dead, so yeah. This is it, I will come back later on and just show you like how it's held up. I'm gonna be out and about for most of the day. It is already half past one. But, you know, I'll come back much later on-ish and show you how it's held up. So I'm gonna say bye now. And I'll finish the video off later on. Okay, bye. So it's back, back again. A while later, but not actually that long. Okay, I'm back. Done all my errands, done all my bits and bobs. It's almost six. So makeup's definitely gone for like six hours, I would say. <laughs> um, ugh. yeah, I still look very good. I would expect to after six hours, but like I said, I was gonna come back and show you. If, oh, I did cheat a little bit. I put on, look, a little tiny outer lash. I did do that, yeah. Yeah, but makeup still looks good. You see, putting very minimal on the forehead is the way to go if you have forehead wrinkles. Got a nice glow, a nice shim shim about me. Lipstick. Lipstick's pretty much gone. I did actually wipe it off after eating my pasta and then put on a tiny bit of Maybelline lipstick on top and it's kind of disappeared. But 
irregardless, like I said, this is my out and about enjoying the day, don't want to wear too much makeup, makeup look. Uh, also great for the gym, I've realised, because I'm totally wearing sportswear right now to make it look like I was out exercising and really couldn't be bothered finding an outfit for today. But yeah, that's the video. I will link all the products down below if you want to check any of them out. And uh, I am going to go edit this video. I'm going to take this makeup off, shower, and then edit this video. And uh, that's that. And then hopefully film Zemera with this. I'm tempted to film with it tonight, but I know if I remove my makeup, my eyes will just water. So, what you want, Sosa? No, mother. I just want to rub my head on the side of your desk because that's all I do all day. That's. Oh, what? What are you so chatty about? Yes, I shall piss off. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this. If you did, give it a thumbs up. Leave me a comment down below. Tell me what you think. Tell me what you want to see next. And uh, subscribe if you haven't already. And that's going to be it for me and Sausage and Potato, who is over there looking at the birdies. So, yeah, thanks for watching. And I hope I'll catch you on the flip side. Bye. You saying bye? Saying bye bye? Bye bye? <laughs> Does that not hurt your little head to do that so much? Hmm? You're gonna flop down if I move back a bit. Don't be shy and do the flop. <laughs> oh dear. Oh, big stretches. Have you had a nice day? Have you had a nice day? Oh, big stretches. Oh, big yawns. Oh.